So, welcome back everyone to Dragon Age Inquisition. I finally beat that stupid loading screen boss and got into this Rayos wing now. And hopefully we can go talk to that guard captain before we lose any approval. And... Where is Hello? he though? Is anyone there? Somebody? Anybody? Yes, but I can't open that. <laughs> what? Whoa. Don't attack the elf. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> I all right. I'm I I don't think I'm hurt. No one's supposed to be here. Briala said Oh, I shouldn't have trusted her. Why? She sent you here? She's behind it. Briella told you to come to this wing of the palace. Not personally. The ambassador can't be seen talking to the servants. We get coded messages at certain locations, but the order came from her. She's been watching the Grand Duke all night. No surprise she wanted someone to search his sister's room. And could anyone else send orders? Is there orders? anyone else who knows the code and the drop location who could have written those orders? I... I don't know. Any of us could do it, but... No. No one else would send me here. It had to be Briala. I wonder about this. What about... So this room belongs to Grand Duchess Florian. It used to. This had been her private room in Halam Shiral since she was a child. But this part of the palace was damaged, and the royal family moved to the guest wing. Oh. Why, how was it damaged? But how did you get in this first? This wing is sealed. How did you get in here? Easy. The door was unlocked. One of the others probably handled it. And you're looking what for what? What were you what? trying to find in Florian's old room? The message didn't say. I should have known it was a setup. Well... You were brave to come. It takes great courage to come to the royal wing unarmed. <laughs> it's not courage to blindly follow Briala's orders into a trap. I knew her. Before. When she was Celine's pet. Now she wants to play revolution. But I remember. She was sleeping with the Empress who purged our alienage. <laughs> oh... And you can testify Would to it? Would you be willing to testify to that, if I asked? Absolutely. If the Inquisition will protect me, I'll tell you everything I know about our ambassador. Go to the ballroom. Find Commander Cullen. He'll keep you safe. Thank you. Make her protect you, Inquisitor. Ooh, hello. This place looks like it's been used. Look, the fire's on. What? Okay, where is this damage that caused them to move out of the this wing? Where? Like, really? Where? Doesn't seem like it's really damaged very much. What was that sound? Something's not right. No, no, it's not right at all. What's over here? I'm surprised that I'm not losing any points yet. Hmm. Now it's something over here. Here. Okay. Now I should try. I think I can get into this room now, can't I? No, I can't. I. Yeah, I can't until I get two more. So I need to find two more to save him and oh I just lost one. Eh, it's you a fine. Painted, or lazy and assholes. When I get out of this, I'll butcher you like the pigs you are. Okay, I'm not going through that door. <laughs> now <laughs> It's obviously that I will be blamed for something or another if I go through that door. <laughs> So, I'm just gonna leave him alone for right now. Now, hello. 
Like really, was the destruction that they were talking about that why is that door blocked off if no one's uh hello i didn't even notice you dead there okay i did notice you too <laughs> uh, i have to i have to save him i have to save this idiot over here what inquisitor what a pleasure i wasn't certain you'd attend you're such a challenge to read. I had no idea if you'd taken my bait. I knew it. I so knew it. Here for a dance. I fear I'm a bit busy at the moment. If you were looking for a dance partner. Yes, I see that. Such a pity you did not save one final dance for me. It was kind of you to walk into my trap so willingly. I was so tired of your meddling. Corypheus insisted that the Empress die tonight, and I would hate to disappoint him. Hmm. Investigate. Why does Corypheus want? Why kill want? the Empress? What does Corypheus want to achieve? Celine's death is a stepping stone on the path to a. Corypheus will enter the Black City. We will cast down your useless maker and usher in a united world, guided by the hand of an attentive god. And why help him? Your Orlesian royalty. Why would you help Corypheus at You think so small, Inquisitor. Why settle for an empire when Corypheus will remake the entire- I admit, I will relish the look on Gaspar's face when he realizes I've outplayed him. He always was a sore loser. And you get out of this what? Exactly what? Is this for you? Ruling? <laughs> the world, of course. I'll deliver the entire south of Thedas and Corypheus will save me. When he has ascended to godhood, I will rule all Thedas in his name. <laughs> oh, she's so stupid. And you... well... It's not too late to end this. You don't have to go through with this, Florian. There's still time to turn back. Oh, my dear Inquisitor, you are so naive. In their darkest dreams, no one imagines I would assassinate Celine myself. All I need is to keep you out of the ballroom long enough to strike. A pity you'll miss the rest of the ball, Inquisitor. They'll be talking of it for years. Kill her. Bring me the marked hand as proof. <laughs> it will make a fine gift for the master. Okay. Oh, let's just... Uh... Can I close this, please? No? I can't close it anytime soon. Okay. I will heal though. And now close it. So, how much time do I have to get back to the ballroom to save her? <laughs> and that means shouldn't I have... Ooh, I should have so talked to... I, s I don't know, maybe I should have gave the evidence beforehand. But maybe it will turn out for the best that I didn't? Never know. Uh, disrupting again. Please don't hit me, just die. Like that. Okay, there's nothing. Come on. Come on. Stop being so slow. Oops. What? Why is it all the way up there? Jeez, Solis. Stop aiming at random locations in the air. I'm not even sure how you managed to do that. Okay. Don't. Okay. Screw it. You guys don't want me to close it. I'll just slap you with a sword. Just slap you with my stick. Take it right to the face, please. Just right to the goddamn face. You know you like it. You know like you like that stick in your face. You so love it. Okay, let's just close this rip, please. Are you still floating in the air up there? Come on. Just Back me up! Thank you. 
Now slapping you with my stick again. It doesn't hurt to slap people with your stick once in a while. They might even like it. I know these guys like it. Why else would they allow me to slap them with my stick? Hmm. Are you guys having dirty thoughts about that? You shouldn't be. I'm talking about this sword here. I call it a stick because well, it's kind of is a stick. Can you please goddamn die? Why aren't you even getting hurt very much either? It's, I think the better question there. Okay, and you have your little friend over there still alive. Ooh, I saw something over there. Just close this. There we go, finally. That. <sighs> I'm not sure why it took so long. In all honesty. Hmm, infused lightning essence. I didn't even get a loot it. I trust his tits. What was all that? Were those demons? There aren't any more of those blasted demons coming, right? Well. Those were, in fact, demons. Good eye. Those were definitely demons. Maker, bless me. Demons? How could there be demons in the fucking Winter Palace? Because of Aunt Justy's tits. But I didn't think he'd feed me the fucking horrors over a damn bill. <laughs> I kind of like this guy. Angus Bird did Duke this Gaspard to you? Duke lured you out here. Well, his sister. But it had to come from him, didn't it? And all that garbage she was spewing doesn't mean anything. Gaspard had to be the mastermind. And you sound Ferelden, though. Sounds Ferelden. I thought you were one of Gaspard's mercenaries. Born and raised in Denerim. Seems like I should have stayed there. The Duke wanted to move on the palace tonight, but he didn't have enough fancy chevaliers, so he hired me and my men. He had to offer us triple our usual pay to come to Orlay. Stinking. Uh, come work for me. Want a new job, one that pays better. The Inquisition can always use a good mercenary company. You hiring? I'm game. Anything's better than this bullshit. You Perfect. want me to talk to the Empress or the Court or sing a blasted song in a chantry? I'll do it. <laughs> oh, I like him. And now I got him. Works out perfectly. Now, what do I have to do? Okay, so I have to get back to the ballroom. <laughs> oh, that sounds a uh, lot easier than it's uh, gonna be, probably. But first, there's something out here. Oh, hello, dead person. I'm st I'm just taking all your money. You don't need it. You're dead already. Okay, okay. You can't even talk back. That's what I like about this. I can take the money. And no one would not- Oh! You know nothing about me taking that money, do you guys? No, you, you didn't hear me talking about it on the way in. But just to make sure... You're gonna die. You already started attacking me anyway, so it doesn't matter too much. And I should barely pay attention to my mana instead of just spamming one button thinking, Oh, it's gonna eventually pop up. I know I'm bad, I'm looting, whatever. I really like looting. And it's not like she can't survive a few extra seconds. So probably not. I'm pretty sure she won't. But anyways, I shall let her wait that long. Because that's where I am. Where does this lead? What? Hey, 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 no, go away. Just die. Uh, 
Oh, it's connected to the volume. Okay. Okay. What? Where did you two come from? Well then. If it's gonna be like this. I don't have the time to deal with you, so I'm just gonna spam AoE. <laughs> and be done with this. There we go. Now as much as I want to loot everything. As much as I really want to. So, so want to. Oh, I really want to. Okay, I'm going to. <laughs> she can survive. Maybe. Probably not. But it doesn't look like there's a timed event. It could be timed and just no, uh, find more statuettes, okay. Find more statuettes, yep. Okay, then I'm done here, bye-bye. Okay, I'm going to go save her. Enough dilly darling. Dilly dally shilly shally. Uh, this way? Yep, this way to the ballroom. I must save her. It's been Hello. Oh, Gaspard is with her. So wonderful. The Empress will begin her speech soon. What should we do? Well. Um. Hmm. Well. Ooh, which one of these two? Expose the Duchess's crime to court, avoiding further bloodshed, or save Celine and then deal with the Duchess? Uh... I think... If I do the top one, Celine might still die, because even though I was exposed to her, that just means they'll start attacking, probably. Even though it says avoid further bloodshed, I could detain the Duchess and save Celine, but what if it wasn't the Duchess who's also after her? It could be also Gaspard. So. Let's talk with Wait here, Colonel. I'm going to have a word with the Grand Duchess. What? There's no time. The Empress will begin her speech any moment. Let's hope this works. We owe the court one more show, Your Grace. Inquisitor. Everyone's watching. The eyes of every noble smile. in the Empire are upon us, Your Grace. Remember to smile. This is your party. You wouldn't want them to think you had lost control. Who would not be delighted to speak with you, Inquisitor? I seem to recall you saying. All I needed was to keep you out of the ballroom long enough to strike. When your archers failed to kill me in the garden, I feared you wouldn't save me this last dance. It's so easy to lose your good graces. You even framed your brother for the murder of a council emissary. It was an ambitious plan. Celine, Gaspard, the entire Council of Heralds. All your enemies under one roof. This is very entertaining, but you do not imagine anyone believes your wild stories. <laughs> that will be a matter for a judge to decide, cousin. Gaspar, you cannot believe this. You know I would never... Ooh. Gaspar?
Um, I'm hoping the guards aren't with Kurefius. You lost this fight ages ago, Your Grace. You're just the last to find out. Oh, they are proof of my actions. <laughs> Your Imperial Majesty, I think we should speak in private, elsewhere. Yes, yes, we should. And Your is this press line for the author? in front of the entire court, Gaspard. You're the spy master. If anyone knew this atrocity was coming, it was you. You don't deny your involvement. I do deny it. I knew nothing of Florian's plans. But you, you knew it all and did nothing. <laughs> I don't know which is better. That you think I'm all-seeing, or that you're trying so hard to play innocent, and failing? Enough! We will not bicker while Tevinter plots against our nation. For the safety of the Empire, I will have answers. Hmm... Gaspard was planning a coup, or... Is the evidence gathered about Gaspard Disfurch poor Brilliana. Um I think the elves do need an ambassador, so her being appointed as that, even if I hate her, gives the elves some respect within their legion, so I'm gonna I help them. Florian in time without Briella's help. You were working together. Of course. We have Gaspard Soda. We have the note to your general ordering him to move troops covertly into the palace grounds. It was a defensive choice. I expected betrayal here, just not by my own sister. Uh -huh. Keep talking, Gaspard. Eventually, you'll convince somebody. He hired mercenaries, His own mercenary too. captain will confirm that Gaspard brought herd thugs into the palace for an attack. Mercenaries? So much for your chevalier honor, cousin. He murdered an and emissary. And he murdered a council emissary in the servants' quarters. I found his bloody knife hidden near the body. Briala found all of this out for your sake, Celine. In light of overwhelming evidence, we have no choice but to declare you an enemy of the Empire. Ba -ba. You are hereby sentenced to death. Ooh. He counts as Selena Brilia or try to convince Selene to spare Gaspard. Damn it. Do I want to save him? He could make a pretty good general. He could help the Inquisition quite a bit against his, the fight. But afterwards, he could end up. S doing something else. Uh, oh. I'm going for the reward. I think Ambassador Briala deserves some reward for uncovering all this. For this service to the Empire, Briala, your previous treachery will be pardoned. But you will have to live in exile. You're too kind. Thank you, Inquisitor. For all your efforts tonight. I'm I sorry, but he's dead. Life, and Orle owes you its future. That was a hard choice there. You have done a service for the Empire never to be forgotten, my friend. This piece is your doing. You truly are the instrument of Andraste. Orle will never forget your part in this. Nor will I. Lords and ladies of the court, the civil war which has plagued us is at an end. The Orlesian Empire is whole again. Those who drove us into war for selfish gain have been dealt with as traitors. Gaspard de Chalon is guilty of treason. He is no longer our cousin and shall never again hold title or land in Orlais. 
We have lost enough. No more! Now, we can move forward to healing and restoration. In our hour of need, the Inquisition has faced these dangers beside us. It is the honor of Orle to stand with Andraste's herald to end this crisis. And in ages to come, our children and grandchildren can say that we left them a brighter world. Will you address the court, my friend? Peace should be Ending the concern. war was the first step. Our final goal must be peace for all, Thedas. Well said, Inquisitor. We of the court must use our resources. Not every battle is won on the field. But that is tomorrow. Tonight, feast, my friends. Enjoy our victory. There will be many more to come. The Orlesian nobility make drunken toasts to your victory, and yet you are not present to hear them. Do you tire so quickly of their congratulations, Inquisitor? It is most fickle, after all your efforts on their behalf. <laughs> they ran out of the punch. Uh, it is good to see Everyone you again. Everyone suddenly wants to talk to me. You, at least, I'm glad to see. <laughs> Then I have happy news, as you shall be seeing a great deal more of me. By Imperial Decree, I have been named Liaison to the Inquisition. Selene wishes to offer you any and all aid, including mine. Congratulations. Investigate. You want to join us? I had no idea you were interested in joining the Inquisition. The assignment has been given to me, regardless of my personal interest. Selene knows you face an opponent who wields great magical power, which is far more important than her own curiosity. You will require my knowledge if you are to defeat such magic. Regardless, Corypheus is a threat to Orle and to myself. Thus, I am not opposed to the appointment. And you can do what, what exactly? Do that would benefit us. I have knowledge which falls beyond the realm of most mages. Demonic rituals? I suspect this is also true of Corypheus, thus it behooves you to add to your arcane arsenal, yes? Mundane knowledge will not bring the rift in the sky to a close, after all. Are you a blood mage? When you mage? say knowledge beyond the realm of most mages, do you mean blood magic? I know many obscure, forgotten, and forbidden arts. Some of it you might consider blood magic, yes? Should thought of that frighten you, allow me to offer reassurance. Knowledge alone does no harm. What I possess I place at your disposal, to make use of or ignore as you desire. Well. Welcome aboard! Welcome to the Inquisition, Morrigan. A most gracious response. I shall meet you at Skyhold. Can I have you in my party and have your shape shifting tree still? <laughs> uh, I guess not. There are at least a dozen young lords and ladies hoping for some time with the hero of the night. Yet here you are, alone. Care to share your thoughts? Oh. Poor Grand Duke. I wish I could have saved you, Gaspard. You never do give up on people, no matter how lost they are. The band still plays. Might I have this dance, Lady Adar? Of course. <laughs> uh. Yes. I'd like that. I didn't know you danced. I did once, in another life. <laughs> well, that's all for this video, guys. So, I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye!